Do you have a nice email signature either in Gmail or Outlook that you're struggling to get into HubSpot? Well, carry on watching this video and I'm gonna show you how easy it is to replicate that signature. The ability to send email from within HubSpot makes things really efficient for you. It means that when you're working uh, in HubSpot, you're either in a contact record or a ticket or a deal or a company, and you want to send an email, you haven't got to close HubSpot down, jump over to another window like Gmail and Outlook and send the email and then jump back to HubSpot. What you can do is you can just hit the email, uh, send email button and you get your email editor comes up and you can send your email from here. But you would have noticed here that there's no signature. Now a lot of clients we speak to say that they're either unaware of how to set up a signature or that they could even set up a signature or that they've tried and couldn't get the formatting correct so they therefore were put off and therefore they don't use this feature. So I'm going to show you just how to, to replicate your email signature from Outlook um, or Gmail and get it looking exactly the same. So there's really three ways of setting up your email signature. You can either start from scratch, building it and typing it out and putting links in, etc. You can cut and paste from an existing signature that you might already have, uh, either in your Gmail or Outlook, for example. Or you can use HTML code if you've got the, the code template that you know how to, uh, uh, how to use. So what we do is we go over to our settings cog and then we select under your preferences, we select general and then we select email and halfway down you've got this edit email signature and you can see mine's blank so as I say you could start from scratch you could start typing in uh, your name position you could put in website and then you can use the rich text uh, editor functions like the link for example so that would link to clue.com and that then becomes a, a link and you can type out all your signature like that okay you can also add in images from here as well but if you've already got a signature um, that you've already done this work you've already done the format and the layout you don't really want to be doing that all again so i'm just going to delete that and uh, i'm going to go over to my gmail and in Gmail, you can see that I've got uh, my signature already uh, formatted. So I'm simply going to cut and paste here. And I'm going to copy that and then uh, paste it into there. And you can see now all the links, etc., are already there. Now, there is a problem when doing this. If you're using images in your original signature, the images aren't going to come across to HubSpot. So you can see where I had the banner. Uh, I've just got this little icon here, which is basically telling me that HubSpot couldn't interpret, uh, couldn't find the image that, it was, uh, that I was asking it to put in there. So I'm going to delete that. And then I'm going to use this little insert image icon. Okay, and then I'm going to upload my image uh, using the add image now I've already done mine and you can see it here okay yeah so if, if when you hit that you get your image library if you've already uploaded your image it would be there if not you just hit the add image and do upload files so let's just generate uh, add that in there and you can see there it is now that's a bit big um, it doesn't really fit into my signature so I'm just going to click on it and I've got the option here to reduce the size to 250 uh, pixels so I'm going to do that and that's about the right size. I'm also now going to add a link because that links to our YouTube channel. So here you can see I've got this uh, link uh, icon. So I'm going to click that. I'm just going to go across and grab, um, grab my address uh, that I want to send people to. So this is actually promoting our YouTube page. So I'm going to go and grab the uh, YouTube page link, enter that into there and press save. And there you go, my, my email signature is now completed and done. As I say, you've also got the option to uh, add in HTML. So if you have your uh, a more of a complex signature and it's all done through code, if you've got access to the code, you can grab the code and just enter it into here. So that's how you sort your signature out. Now that, that will automatically now be put on any emails that you send from within HubSpot, whether you do it through uh, the sequences tool or whether you do it as one-to-one. -one. 
Now I hope you found that useful and if you did please give us a like and also subscribe to the channel so that you can be notified of any other content that we put out on a regular basis. Also if you have any questions or if you uh, have any suggestions of content you'd like us to produce for you please put that in the comments box below. Again hope that helps and thank you very much for watching.